done. Yeah, there we go. Now we can hear. All right, everyone. Welcome to the Junkyard Job Cast. I'm Andrew. I'm your host for today. Um, bit of a short stream. I don't think it's going to take too long. I don't think we're going to take longer than 10, maybe 15 minutes. Um, so not awards. Uh, I think that was wrong on Justin's part. He didn't mean to type awards there. We have a special announcement, though. Um, and this is something we've been working on for a while, so I kind of wanted to um, do something a little bit different for our announcement on it instead of what we usually do. We're going to try this. So, anyways, without further ado, we're going to get into it. Uh, let's talk about who we are really quick. Um, Team Jawa is a group of X-Wing players we met through online tournaments throughout this whole COVID-19 pandemic. Um, we've been running events since uh, June of 2020 is when we started. Um, that was our first event. Um, since then, we've been doing... Uh, we have we, lo we will have done nine events um, starting this Sunday is when the next one starts. Um, and then that will be nine events for us over the past year, uh, which has been a lot. It's been fun, but it's been a lot. Um, but we've averaged about 60 people per event, which is pretty dang good. Um, I'm pretty happy with that. Uh, awesome, thank you. Thank you for that sub. I see that there. Um, that's just a little bit of background. Um, the reason I'm kind of doing this here too is I, I want this video to be spread uh, pretty wide once it goes to YouTube. Um, so I, I kind of want to give people the background if you aren't familiar with the Junkyard Jawa cast, with Team Jawa, with who we are. Um, I think that helps a little bit for what we're going to announce. But anyways, uh, what's this all about? So we love doing tournaments and making fun prizes. That's what we really enjoy doing. That's why we do these things. You know, I've got I actually got a prize shipment today of some cool cards from Daniel. These watercolor series, I love them. Um, I got some templates in. Star Fox Barrel templates. Um, we love making these cool prizes for you guys. Um, for us, really, is who it's for. <laughs> you guys just help us fund it. Um, but we decided we want to put some of these skills we've learned at planning events into good use. Um, and what I mean by that is, while doing tournaments and events is fun, uh, we want to do something a little bit more meaningful um, coming up. So, with that in mind, we're doing a charity event. So, enter Metaviver. Let's talk about this charity really quick. So, Metaviver is a nonprofit that helps people going through stage 4 metastatic breast cancer. Uh, all funds, all donations they receive... Um, go to the treatment of MBC, uh, education on resources for patients, um, advocating the needs for these patients. Um, everything about this is, um, this organization is, is founded on helping out these people going through this really tough, um, tough disease. Um, I think uh, you can go on their website and learn more about it, statistics. Um, between 250 and 280,000 Americans each year are diagnosed with this. Um, so it's it's a lot. I mean, that's a quarter of a million people each year. Um, so, I mean, I, I'm sure we all know someone who's been affected by breast cancer or cancer in general. Um, you know, my uh, my wife's family, um, very much affected by cancer. Um, very, you know, very important cause to a lot of us, I think. Um, anyways, with that being said, what are we going to do to help them? So... While NBC can target people of any gender, um, it's most prevalent in women. Um, you know, it, it, just breast cancer in general, again, it is something that you always need to get checked out regardless of your gender, but it is most prevalent in women. So what we're doing is putting on an event, an event, excuse me, putting on an event um, that celebrates the female characters in our favorite tabletop game. Um, so this is The Woman of Star Wars. Uh, this is an extended 2.0 tournament with a twist. Uh, entry fee is really pay what you want. Um, our tiers are really centered around 15 or 30. Um, either one of those are your um, kind of options. Um, but honestly, if it comes down to, you know, you can only pay... If you want to pay 17, that's fine. If you want to pay 20, that's fine too. If you want to pay 50, I mean, that's more than welcome. Uh, I want to be upfront about this. Um, we are keeping costs as low as we can um, on our end. Uh, I, right now, uh, we say this in the rules document, it is stated on the TTO page. Um, uh, up to $3 for each entry is going to be used for prizes, and that's it. Um, 
that's a maximum. The more players we get, the lower that's probably going to be. Uh, just because shipping, um, you know, if you end up just participating and your shipment is one card, I mean, that one card isn't going to take $3 a ship. That's going to take, you know, 50 cents. It's going to take a, a stamp to ship. Um, but at maximum, we are going to be spending $3 per player. That is our hard cap. Anything beyond that is coming out of our pockets. Um, uh, specifically, um, mine, Justin's, uh, and Kyle. Uh, the three of us have been really working hard on this one. Um, uh, but this is a single day event, well, two day event. Um, but usually we do these league style events, which are played over uh, each round is usually 72 to 96 hours, depending on the tournament. Um, but this one, we want to do a weekend tournament, just all in one, just make it pretty clear, make it a big event about it. Um, so Swiss rounds, it's going to happen on May 15. Um, that is uh, not about a month from next Saturday, roughly. Um, so you've got plenty of time to prepare to let your uh, uh, respective family members know that you're going to be out of commission for that day. Um, and if you make the cut, we're going to do that cut the following day on the 16th. Um, Check-in is going to start at 7 a.m. PST. Um, it's welcome to people of all uh, nationalities. However, Metaviver is important. I'm pretty sure they only operate within America. Um, just so you know. Just being, you know, fully transparent about that. Um, and also, you know, the 7 a.m. PST is pretty early for you West Coast folk for check-in. But we wanted to get a time zone that would appeal to the majority of players or at least time frame. Um, as far as number of rounds, we don't know how many there will be. That all depends on you. Depends on how many players we get signed up. Um, in our rules document, we have a breakdown of um, we have a breakdown of rounds, number of players in the cut, um, all that stuff. Just dependent on the number of entries we get. So let's talk about that twist here. So each list has to have two female pilots. Um, and if you go to our uh, go to our rules page, you can see the whole breakdown for every faction. Um, it's I believe we've gotten everyone. If we've missed a pilot, please let us know. We'll add her to the list. Um, big uh, asterisk with this, one, with this one because CIS is so limited um, as a faction in terms of you know most of their pilots are droids and droids can be gendered in the Star Wars universe. Uh, for example, L3 from Solo um, is clearly gendered female. Uh, C-3PO is um, more gendered male. Um, but because these are mostly ungendered, that restriction becomes oh, a single restriction for Sis. Of you either need to have um, Zam Crew, um, Zam Pilot, or K2B4. K2B4 is another female, um, uh, a female gendered droid, as we've seen in Clone Wars. Um, Trigger Happy, we will get a, um, there will be a TTO link uh, attached um, at, or posted after this video, after the stream. Um, if you are watching this on YouTube later, um, the TTO link will be in the description of this video. Um, now, uh, because we're celebrating women here and celebrating, you know, the female pilots that we have here, uh, there will be bonus prizes available uh, for lists that have all female pilots or alternatively, if you have a generic um, if you have a female crew on that generic, you know, let's say, for example, you want to bring a uh, blue squadron scout U-Wing. If you put Leia crew on that scout, then that counts. That counts towards your uh, all-female goal. Um, it just doesn't count for your all uh, for your two female restriction. Um, you still need at least two female pri uh, pilots. So uh, as Justin mentioned here in the chat, um, there's lots of sweet prizes. We are going to get to those pretty quick. So we've got prizes from all over the X-Wing community. Um, I'm really, really astounded by how many people that Justin has been able to corral into this event and ask for prizes, and everyone's been so generous. Um, we've got Kuwait Print Yards, who, if you don't know, makes great 3D printed X-Wing um, accessories. So we're talking tokens, dial covers, uh, tournament boxes. Um, I, for one, love his dial covers. He's made some really cool stuff for us uh, in the past. Um, definitely check out his store if you haven't. Code Paul Creatives, I'm pretty sure we all know, um, as you know, one of the uh, one of the tops here in the whole like X-wing uh, sub industry we've developed here. Um, this template right here, this little like Star Fox template, is wonderfully laser cut by Andrew at CPC. Uh, he does a great job. Um, he's donated a lot to this too. Uh, Drainus Art, if you don't know, uh, Drainus is an artist that does alt art cards. He's a very realistic alt art cards. 
Um, they're excellent. They're beautiful. They're stunning. Um, Dranus has graciously donated, I believe, 100 cards. Um, I could be wrong. Um, I don't remember how many, but it's a lot. Uh, Dranus was really generous. Uh, 120 cards, according to Justin. That's a lot. That's crazy. Um, Enigma Wargaming, uh, the best X-Wing repainter, if you ask me. Um, and I am an X-Wing repainter as well. Uh, but Enigma Wargaming has donated um, some vouchers for repaints uh, for some of his fantastic missions. Um, District Foundry, they do t uh, template trays. They do tournament boxes, some other designs. Um, they des they're going to donate a tournament box of this. A hybrid design is donating a template tray. Uh, and Pim Miniatures, that's me, um, donating some uh, commission vouchers as well. So if you don't win the, the top tier Drainus ones, or the uh, top tier Enigma ones, you can get the, the B level, uh, if you will. Um, also, I do want to shout out uh, Brant Francis and the Perky Nerd out of Burbank, California. Um, I'm going to bring them up again later, but they are also one of our prize partners I didn't put on this list. I just forgot to. Um, like I said, we've gotten donations from all over the X-Men community. It is um, absolutely massive uh, and, and, you know, staggering how many cool people are involved in this. Um, but let's talk about at least what you can actually win. So at the $15 level, um, you will receive a watercolor series alt of a pilot from the faction you play. Um, these are all designed by Daniel Chance. Um, this is before the overlay. If you want an example with the overlay, you can see this right here, Wedge Antilles. Um, this is a really good example of his work. Um, he does a great job, Daniel does. Um, so, uh, if you're playing Republic, you're going to be getting an Ayla Secura. Uh, CIS is getting Zam. Um, Resi uh, Resi Resistance, excuse me, gets Ray. Um, we've got, uh, I don't know who that is for Scum or for Imperial. Maybe Justin can help me out. Uh, or actually FO, but I think FO is Malrus. Um, and then Leia for Rebels, of course. Um, that is Ketsu for Scum. Oh, yeah, I just didn't recognize the helmet. Yep. Ketsu for Scum, Sienna for Imperials, Malrus for FO. There you go. Um, all participants will also receive a random card from Drainus Alt. Uh, Arts, excuse me. Um, again, Drainus is donating 120 cards. We aren't anticipating more than 120 signups. But <laughs> if we do, we'll get you some of the cards anyways. Um, oh, also important to note, these are all flip cards, which means they double side either pilot and then crew. Um, uh, so you've got, you know, uh, Ray or Ray Gunner in her case, not crew. Um, that's really cool. I, I'm really looking forward to these. But if you enter at the $30 level, um, this is going to be really exciting. Uh, at the $30 level, um, you're going to receive a Jawa ribbon enamel pin. Um... So these are some custom pins with our Jawa logo um, and that ribbon, um, of course, supporting uh, breast cancer awareness and research. Um, you will also be eligible to win a raffle for a hybrid design tray. If you haven't used hybrid designs trays, they're excellent, um, fantastic design. I use one every time I play X-Men in real life. Um, top 32. This is, again, where we're going to shout out the Perky Nerd out of Burbank, California local game store. Um, top 32 players will receive this uh, Larma de Arce and um, Wairobi Tice, Tice, I think. Uh, Alter card. It's a flip card. On one side, you've got Larma. The other side, you've got Wairobi. Um, Wairobi being the A-Wing pilot, Larma being the resistance crew. Uh, top 32 players will also get a Curled Paw Creatives Challenge coin. Um, the design for that one isn't complete yet. We'll show it off as soon as we get it. Top 16 players are going to receive this beautiful Padme Almadala Alt uh, Art Nuevo Alt Art card. Um, I the pi the uh, artist name I the glad to put on here. I apologize. The artist name is on the prize sheet. Um, they will also be getting a pin from Curled Paw Creatives. Um, again, not sure on the design on that one, um, but as soon as we have it, we'll be sharing it with you all. Uh, if you were to get to the top eight, you're going to get a whole smorgasbord of fantastic prizes. Um, from Kuwait Print Yards, you're going to get this really cool focus stress uh, token that flips on one side to be a focus stress, then the other side is a stress token. It's great for your A-Wings, for your Fang Fighters, um, for your uh, Star Vipers, etc. You're also going to get an Ion stress token, so one side's Ion, one side's a stress. And the other one's, last but not least, a Deplete on one side, strain on the other one. Um, and then from CPC... 
from Curl Paw Creatives. Uh, you're gonna get a full set of maneuvering templates. Um, Andrew is like absolutely not me, Andrew Knuckles. Um, uh, he, he's gone far out of his way uh, to help us out with this event. We really appreciate him, all of our other sponsors, of course. Uh, let's keep going though. If you reach the top four level, uh, again from Kuwait Print Yards, we have these fabulous dial covers. So we've got a Captain Phasma, an ETA Ada, uh, that is designed to be after Ayla Secura's blue and uh, off-white model. Um, a seventh sister, and then a Fang Fighter that you can use for Joy Rakoff. Uh, the Fang Fighter, I think, comes with that lock insert, which is pretty cool. You just pop it out of the dial cover when you want to take a lock on someone. Um, so if you get the top four, you're going to get one of these. Uh, the way this will work is the person who gets number one, they're going to pick first, then it's two, three, four. Uh, the, four who, the person who picks fourth gets the remaining um, these are really cool. I again, I personally use a lot of KPY KPY dial covers. Um, I think it's really cool stuff. Um, let's keep going though. If you reach the top two, you will receive all of these previous prizes I've mentioned, um, as well as that voucher for an Enigma Wargaming commission. Um, again, Enigma Wargaming he is out of England. Um, it's going to be a twenty-five pound voucher which is about $35 right now that can change ebb and flow with uh, the way um, uh, the way exchange rates work. Um, but he does fantastic work. Uh, I, I highly recommend you follow him on these social medias. Um, see some of his great stuff. This is an example of a resistance squad he's done. It's just magnificent. If you become the champion of our event, you're going to get a tournament box from District Foundry with the tournament logo on the lid. That's that great... Uh, double uh, ribbon Woman of Star Wars logo with a silhouette of Padme and Leia. Um, this box is going to be really cool. I'm looking forward to it. Looking forward to see the, seeing the final thing. Um, now, uh, if your list cr uh, contains all female pilots, this is one of those bonus prizes we talked about. Um, or if you have a generic pilot, as long as it has a female crew, that will still count. Um, you will receive the Top 16 Art Nuevo Padme Alt. That's the one that we uh, showed off a while back. Um, and you'll be entered into the chance to win one of three commissions from me, Pin Miniatures. Got some example of my work there. Um, yeah, I I'm pretty open to whatever you want. So, happy to work with you. Let's say you can't play, but you still want to help. Uh, we do know that these single day events tend to turn some people off. Um, it's a big commitment to be able to sit in front of your computer for... 12 hours and then potentially another eight hours the next day um and we certainly aren't you know we appreciate it if you do um but if you just want to help us re like donate i mean we accept if you want to just donate you know here's five dollars or something um by all means we'll take that um and if we have leftover prizes i'm sure we'll try to get you something um no guarantees because we really don't know what we're going to end up with um uh but we also are going to have streaming partners day of Right now we have uh, 312 Squadron and Nickel City X-Wing signed on uh, to promote this um, event. If you are a streamer and you want to help us out, um, feel free to contact me through the Jawa Discord. I am also known as Yellow Jacket Pim. Um, contact me. We can get something set up. I'll help you uh, get ready for the event. Um, day of will probably just be, you know, you pick what table you want and we'll get uh, those players on stream. So, um, but if you want to stream this, please, again, get in contact with me. Uh, we're going to have some great partners. It's going to be a lot of fun. Um, now I'm going to call in, uh, really the guy who's been pushing a lot of these prizes who came up with this in 16th. Uh, here we go. Going to give Justin a call. Not that you can't see that. Hey, can you hear me? Hello there. I can. Can you All right. hear me? Yep. You should be on the stream now. Hello, everyone. Sorry, uh, give me just a moment. I'm going to close my door because the other people in my house are converting with me. <laughs> <laughs> All right. All righty, I am back. Um, so thank you all for watching this presentation by Andrew. Uh, he put this together real quick, uh, I believe, just today. Yeah. Yeah, uh, very good presentation. <laughs> Pretty much covered everything that uh, that I feel like needs to be said. Uh, just to reiterate, the tournament will take place May 15th. 
that is the weekend after Mother's Day. Um, I've already made the channels in the Team Jawa Discord server, so make sure to join that if you are interested. Um, and I will be announcing that really shortly. Um, also, like to just thank Enigma District Foundry, Curled Pot Creatives, Drainus, uh, Pim Miniatures, Hybrid, and Kuat Print Yards, real quick, just for donating. Uh, originally, when we were putting this together, it was literally just the uh, the watercolors and uh, and the pins. So you know, these guys have have really stepped up and uh, donated so much stuff because uh, we're not we're not paying for pretty much any of this. Uh, it's all being donated. Yeah, the I mean, of the, of their heart. They're, they're all being extremely generous with these prizes. I mean, again, it's it's just I'm 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 really staggered by how much these guys have all been. Um, willing to donate and just you know help us out with this yeah and i i would also like to thank everybody who's who's turning it into the stream uh at this moment um want to make this really 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 big we want to get as much in as we can to donate over to metaviver um so like any any time that that you guys think that uh, you can maybe get someone interested in this or even just to donate we'd really really appreciate it because you know we're trying to we're trying to raise as much money as possible so I'm just a just a call to action for everybody who's who's watching this to uh, do your part and try to get as many people into this as you can. Yeah, absolutely. Um, like I said earlier, we've averaged about 60 players per event as we've done it, um, which is pretty big. I mean, we're pretty lucky to be able to do that, um, and we've been able to do some cool prizes because of it. Um, but for this one, we really want to, like I said, we want to, like Justin said too, we want to get as much as we can from Metaviver for this one. Um, so share it far and wide and encourage people to sign up. Um, and again, in the, in the, uh, for the sake of full transparency, um, we're not going to be used, uh, we're not going to be using more than $3 for any entry on, um, logistics costs on our end. Um, everything that we're trying to keep down below that we're going to use as little as we can. Um, we just want to have some, a bit of a, uh, logistical buffer, um, just so we can get these prizes to you guys. Exactly. And uh, there's some really, really cool prizes. In fact, I think this is our most heavily, or our, our biggest uh, prize-heavy tournament we've done so far, uh, ironically enough. Yeah, yeah. It turns <laughs> out you can do a lot when everyone just donates prizes. Um, yeah. uh, Andy and uh, Pugs, if you guys are just joining in, um, this will be on uh, YouTube later. Um, it will be shared. Um, we'll have it uh, the, the TTO link up. Um, if you're watching this on YouTube, the TTO link should be in the description of this video along with the discord link for the server um and any other information you might need um everything uh will be on there in terms of prizes um the format everything like that um other than that i mean again uh if you're a small streamer you want to help stream the event please reach out to me through on discord um i'm andrew l and the jawa server i'm yellow jacket pim and a lot of x-wing servers um you can find me around um but again um, we're really looking forward to this event. We hope we see you guys out there. Um, even if you can't participate, even if you just donate a dollar or something, you know, that's going to be going uh, directly to Metaviver, uh, which then goes in the hands of the people who can use it most um, to help fund this stage for um, meta uh, metastatic breast cancer research um, and awareness. Um, so, um, with that, I mean, that's all I've got to say for you guys. Uh, we, I just hope we see you there. Um, Justin, do you have anything else? No, that's about it. Um, thank you all for watching. I yeah. uh, hope that we can see you in the tournament. And if not, hope you'll make or uh, consider a small donation um, for those that can't make it. And uh, looking forward to running this tournament for you. Yep. It's going to be really fun. I'm um, looking forward to it day of. Um, we hope you guys uh, join in. We hope you. this is a good cause. We really, um, really think this is going to be a big event. We want it to be big. Um, but again, you know, we just want to, we, we could, we will not be able to do this without the generous donations of all of our sponsors and, you know, for you guys, for the players. Um, so be sure to share this far and wide, um, participate if you can, if not, we get it. Um, but just consider playing and consider donating. So, all right, that's all I got for you guys today. Um, again, this video will be put on YouTube very shortly. Um, and after that, um, I, the, the link should be going live later tonight for the TTO page, Justin. 
Uh, the everything should be live now. Actually, I okay. just uh, I just posted it in our Discord server, and it sounds like people have already shared it. Uh, I actually heard Fly Better plug it live on their podcast. That should there be you go. Uh, should be available to listen. There you tomorrow, go. So. How about that? Um, in that case, guys, uh, I'm gonna uh, call it quits for the Jawa cast today. Uh, we'll be coming back with more uh, X-wing content. Uh, I'm sure coming soon. Um, but definitely be on the lookout for this event and uh, as we learn more details about it and keep sharing stuff about it. Um, really looking forward to this one. All right, thanks, thanks. guys.